You, so I'm hoping you save 75% of a half a pint, right? The little bottle, or are you talking about the big bottle? Big bottle. Yeah, the normal Okay. <laughs> okay, that's a bad example. <laughs> okay, how many in here are light drinkers? Okay, so how many, how many, what do you, what's your drink of, favorite drink of choice? For Sterling Stewart Jr., his job as athletic director for Savannah State University is a workation. Stewart, who started his fourth year in the position this school year, says he has wanted to be in the position since he was a little kid. So he doesn't see it as just a job, it's a dream. Stewart is a native of New Orleans, Louisiana. He attended the University of Southern Mississippi in Hattiesburg, Mississippi, where he received his bachelor's and master's degree in 1993 and 1996, respectively, in human performance and recreation. In his position as Director of Intercollegiate Athletics at Savannah State, Stewart is responsible for all matters related to managing Savannah State's NCAA Division I sports team for men and women, including budgeting, compliance with the university, University System of Georgia, and NCAA policies and rules, and fundraising for programmatic needs. Uh, I worked with Stewart for the last, well, since he got here. I was here before he got here. So I've been able to see the difference between uh, before and now. I mean, since he's been here, we moved to the MEAC. We've got uh, multiple conference championships between our sports teams. He's taken us to a different direction, to a more professional direction, to build us to the next level, to be a major mid, uh, a major mid major within the NCAA. Um, his goals, uh, they're they're very attainable. It just takes everybody working together to get them done. Uh, but it's 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 a pleasure working with him. Mr. Stewart, he's a very hands-on athletic director, and I like that because I see him at practices all the time. He's always at the games. He's on the field. He's on the sideline, and, he, and, he, and he's passionate about Savannah State. He likes us to come together, like us to win. That's the number one thing about him. And to get that type of vibe from an athletic director, it makes me as a player want to play harder. It makes me want to go hard because my, my athletic director is deeply invested. That's my coaches, as the players is. I mean, it makes me want to play harder. And overall, for athletic director, that, that's good. Like I like that because he can motivate a team. He motivate all sports. And we see him all the time, and that's what I like most about him. Very hands-on and direct. For instance, if I have if it's homecoming or the week before homecoming, do I worry about the basketball floor being covered, or do I worry about the activities and making sure that all the tickets and all of that is up and running for homecoming? So you, you look at what is pressing or what's urgent, and then you decide on how to pick, how to address those issues. As an athletic director, what do you believe is your best asset? Well, I'm not just the athletic director, I'm also the janitor. So, um, now my, my um, I think my best asset is uh, the ability to juggle multiple tasks at the same time and still afford or create a, a really good product.